Aloha and welcome to Kapalua Maui, home to off-road triathlon's greatest day and the 23rd Xterra Annual World Championship. Today, more than 750 of the world's fastest amateur and elite triathletes from 44 countries put their mental and physical toughness up against Mother Nature. Maui is a beautiful place. I think this is my eighth time here and every time it gets harder to leave. Um, it, it's a really relaxed environment, which I really like. Um, there's so many amazing beaches, so if you want to, you know, get away and get somewhere quiet, it's really easy to. Um, and yeah, I just love the, you know, love the food around here and going out and the, all the little unique shops, so it's an amazing place to visit. Xterra Worlds is the culmination of a series of qualifying races held in more than 30 countries around the Xterra planet. And for the elites, there was a $100,000 prize purse at stake. An incoming North Swell brought big surf to the start line and overnight rain made the trails nice and muddy, creating challenging conditions for the Xterra tribe. The race featured Maui's most competitive elite men's field ever assembled. Sam Osborne and Roger Serrano were the first out of the water. The chase pack with Brad Weiss, Ruben Razafa and Rom Atkinson were just a minute behind. Razafa, a three times Maui winner, posted the fastest bike split for the sixth straight year but Atkinson was just 40 seconds behind him heading out onto the run. By mile two, the Costa Rican passed Rosafa and never looked back, taking the tape in two hours, 52.41. Weiss did the fastest run to move into second, Osborne placed third, Rosafa fourth, and Josiah Midow rounded out the top five. In the women's race, Michelle Flippo from Mexico was the fastest swimmer, but the Scottish rocket Leslie Patterson dominated the rest of the day by posting the fastest bike and run splits to win her third Xterra World Championship title. Flippo held on for second, with the speedy Kiwi Lizzie Orchid in third, Susie Snyder in fourth, and Brigida Poor in fifth. I had an amazing race. I gave it everything I could from the swim. I had a good swim, I had a great bicycle. I was amazed that I pulled about a minute off of Rusapa coming into transition and I ran with everything I had and I just gave it out and this race is for Costa Rica. Pura vida. It was an awesome, awesome day for me. Very hard and frustrating for everyone uh, given the conditions but I just felt strong and patient all day and really nice to deliver. Uh, the swim was tough, there was big waves, there was a lot of swell, uh, the bike was just muddy, there was a lot of hike-a-bike, the run was brutal, it was sli slipping and sliding all over the place, so it was tough. 